Unit 2 Social Media Finding a Balance Read about it. As soon as Harry wakes up in the morning, he reaches for his smartphone. He always keeps it under his pillow in case he gets any text message overnight. Even before he gets out of bed, Harry checks Instagram to see what his friends have been doing. He spends a lot of time interacting with his virtual friends rather than socializing with his school friends. But he doesn't feel lonely. Harry had a wonderful birthday this year. He logged into Facebook and found several birthday messages from members of his Japanese manga Facebook club. Later, Facebook posted his birthday video online. It reminded him of his best friend from elementary school, Nathan, who moved away a few years ago. He then contacted his old friend through Facebook Messenger. They had a nice chat and decided to get together during winter vacation. However, Harry's happiness did not last long. He arranged a date for the following Saturday with his online club friend, Kathy. Harry was so excited that he spent hours surfing the net to look for the anime restaurant. However, when Harry saw Kathy, he was disappointed because he didn't think she was as attractive as her selfies. The food and service at the restaurant that had gotten great reviews turned out to be very awful. What's worse, It seemed that Kathy knew little about Japanese manga. The conversation was awkward for Harry. Later, Kathy even asked Harry to lend her $1,000 NT dollars. Harry turned her down, and thus Kathy posted the picture of their lunch on Instagram and made a remark about how stingy Harry was. The negative comments that followed left Harry speechless and furious. Nothing could be further from the truth. When Harry met Nathan during vacation, He complained to his friend about Kathy. Nathan comforted Harry, telling him that his aunt had a similar bitter experience. They talked about the pros and cons of social media. Nathan reminded Harry that some positive aspects of social media are helping old friends keep in touch and people connect with others all over the world who have similar interests. Besides, Nathan told Harry that the things he reads and sees on social media aren't always accurate and don't always reflect the truth. Big data allows social media to monitor, collect, and share personal information about all computer users based on the issues they pay attention to and the celebrities they follow. Businesses then analyze this information and take advantage of it to market products or services tailored to each person staring at a screen. There's no telling how many Japanese manga advertisements I've seen on Facebook, admitted Harry. Through his experiences with Kathy and Nathan, Harry now understands that it is essential that he should learn the truth about social media. Although he is aware that technology plays an important part in his life, Harry has realized he needs to be a smarter technology user and to find an ideal balance between the virtual and real worlds.